Hello. Episode 5 of this playthrough of Civilization 6. Sound is a bit dodgy still. Um, I've turned the volume on my mic down a bit. May help, but um, not much because there's some fault in the software. Just get the screen going and continue. Right. And I'm Australia, but everybody else is ancient civilizations. And I think there's still a bit of a war going over here in Eastern Europe. Um, having said that, I don't see much signs of it anymore. Damaged unit here. Gorgo seems to have no units left almost. A catapult, a crossbow, that's, that's a couple, and a horse, yeah. Not a lot. In fact, none of them been, seem to have much left. Which is fine. They're on the other side of the world to me. India has loads of units. Don't really want to annoy them. <clears throat> At least not once they get properly ocean going anyway. But I would like to stick a city up here. I know Japan has already nicked Sumatra. I've got Borneo. <clears throat> and probably I'll get a bit of Java too. But maybe I should quickly plonk a settler up here up here somewhere to just for the sake of it. Maybe on the corner just Or maybe even one in Malaysia somewhere. And here. Vietnam and all that. Might annoy the Chinese, but this is good good land. Hmm. I haven't finished populating Australia, New Zealand and all that yet. But there's good resources here, look at them. Time to build a load more settlers, I suppose. Technically, it says I'm still in the lead. Not for culture. Not surprising. Let's I'm get on our knees and pray. I don't know to whom. Is there a patron saint of ballistics yet? It is nationalism which engenders nations, and not the other way around. Yeah. Arabia leading for domination, really? What's going on over here then? Lots and lots of units heading up towards Suma. And the odd city over here, well, yes, they have been expanding quite a bit. And they have, well, lots and lots of ancient units, plus their special Mamluks, which are quite powerful. Egypt has a few, but it has lost, has it lost its cap capital? Yeah. Hmm. Egypt is doomed by the looks of this. Didn't even know there was a war on. <laughs> well. Religious victory, I, I can't be bothered sending out missionaries. It seems infeasible to me to convert every country to my religion. 
mean, maybe you play this game and you do that. But uh, to me, I'll be sending out missionaries and apostles and stuff, and they'll just make a few of their own and cancel it all out. It seems a bit difficult. That's why I tend to go for the good old science victory. Build a rocket and get the hell out of here. Right. Great something. A great admiral. Any other villagers on this continent? I don't think so. It's very unlikely. I probably need to go to South America. What am I doing? Go away. Right. Tierra del Fuego, Falkland Islands. It's not a separate island here, Tierra del Fuego. Hmm. Well, I don't see any villagers here. Can he explore yet? No, too close to tribal village. There has to be one somewhere. There. Oh, the Admiral, yes. Well, okay. Um, get onto the boat then. Hey? Who's he? Another one. Join that boat. Come on. Well, go on then. Hop it. Or maybe I can't. Maybe he's just arrived this turn. outside my... I should have gone to the bananas. It's outside my city. Maybe I'm just going bananas. He wants nitre! He can't have it. It's a strategic resource. Nope. Since you declared war on me in the past, you are not getting the ability to build weapons if you haven't got it already. Scumbag. I mean, dear friend.
The extra food there should help from from the. Uh, Shrine. But I'm going ahead building holy vi holy villages anyway. Maybe I'm wasting my time there with that if I'm not going to send out apostles and what have you. What's the point? I don't know. What has logic got to do with anything, eh? Maybe I should start sending out some pestilential missionaries and apostles and stuff. I should at least start buying a few, shouldn't I? I could maybe convert, say, Japan. I mean, just for the heck of it, I suppose it's not the end of the world if I don't. But I can have a go, eh? <clears throat> I might even win a religious victory, just in case. How long would it take to build that? 25 turns. Or I could build a university in nine. University first. No holy site, oh dear. It's a bit of a shame. I don't have that many holy sites at all, do I? Like, do. Not even all my cities are actually of my religion yet. I don't know. Let's go. I think university provides a bit of housing. <clears throat> Looks like I need to send some apostles out to murder these uh, missionaries. I mean, to persuade them of the error of their ways. However beautiful the strategy, you should occasionally look at the results. However beautiful the strategy, remember that politics, colonialism, imperialism and war also originated in the human brain. Missionary Aussieism. So let's go to somewhere well out of the way. Where is he going or what? Apostle, okay. Up here quickly. Oh, he was he was eligible. For, oh, evangelized belief. I think that's where I can add another 
another goodie. Actually, that might be a good idea. I can do it with a nectar. I don't know what I'm looking for here, just something. Yeah, I should have promoted the Apostle, shouldn't I? Come along then. Envoys. Now some nitre for her might be a good idea. I only have two though. That will probably prevent me building my own units, except that I have a few encampments so it's not that crucial. Hmm. That would give her the ability to fight off some of those Guys, okay, let's try it. Okay. Cause a bit of chaos in Europe if she can build some decent units. Now this one can be promoted, let's see. Three extra spreads were moving adjacent to natural wonder for the first time. Which is like, I've got um, Ayers Rock there, oh sorry, Uluru, Uluru or something. Relic is created if the apostle dies in theological combat. That could be really good, but I'm not really going for a culture victory anymore. I'm not, I mean, I've no hope of it really. Well, I've got some hope, but I'm not. So let's go for that. And go to Uluru. Go on. Plus three. Plus one housing. I mean, plus three reduction. Well, all right. I know there's an arena, but I don't need the amenities. So, okay. Better units. It's worth having. Builder, what are you doing? Build a camp, then.
develop what I've got and holy site later. Now here, a temple for my holy site? Yes. This one's super powered site here. I thought I had sent him back already. Can't move yet, it's just crazy. Okay, choose production. Let's get some walls. Ah, he's next to the holy site, that's good enough. That's really good. Prostatizer. Respect eliminates 75% of the existing pressure from other other religions. Okay. Superpower the guy. I should have a few apostles to keep the foreign religions out of Australia, at least, I suppose. Never criticise a rifleman until you've walked a mile in his shoes. That way, he'll be barefoot and you'll be out of range. Move it. Stable for cavalry class units. I'll do that. Barracks are elsewhere. Stable here, maybe. Everywhere else has been done already in this town. So I'll keep him hanging around until needed. Should be building apostles a bit more frequently than I am if I'm going to do any sort of religious victory.
Uh -huh, war against Cleopatra, she's going to die soon. I wonder if I can assist her. Doesn't look like it. Can't think of anything she could do with. Nothing she needs really. That I can offer. I keep doing next turn instead of building apostles. And missionaries. Now they're going away and they failed to convert these cities, but they did convert Sampan, or whatever it's called, Sandpit. Why are they going away without converting? Not able to discuss. Let's try establishing a residence. <coughs> Pardon me. Hopefully, I can debate with him about um, not converting my cities. But he hasn't done so. So maybe it's not a big deal. Now, never mind next turn. Perth. I can't do anything there. I don't have a holy city. Sydney. Um, missionary, Broken Hill, Missionary, whatever it's called, Yalzra, Missionary. Now, evangelize belief, but he has this superpower now, doesn't he? Of, um, yeah, he's gained three extra spreads, presumably, now. So he's, well, he's worth not evangelizing the belief. What about him? Can I do something extra with him An Extra belief. Extra religious spread. Or extra science. E by gum. Maybe I can evangelize more than once, I don't know. Let's go for religious spread because it's it's so tough. Well he's gone past a wonder. So let's send him off. Let's send him to here at least. I 
I could put a second settle on this island, couldn't I? Here, I don't know, here maybe. On Borneo. Is this Tahiti? I'm not sure. Hmm. Yep, I'll have an embassy. Pleases Greece. Has she taken oh they're still at war by the looks of it. She hasn't built any super duper units with the nitro I gave her yet, but I guess it will take a while. This city looks like it's gonna go. Send them all to Sampan. Or Sampit or whatever it's called to start with. I don't like these guys hanging around. I have an apostle here, yes. And I click next turn without building any more again. It's kind of okay, I only have plus 86 faith a turn. If I spend it all, I probably won't, won't be able to get anywhere anyway. I need to build up a reserve of <clears throat> apostles and what have you. Still can't attack him. <clears throat> Why not? I need a guru to heal these guys. I can only build a missionary. Why? No temple. Ah. Oh. Maybe. Maybe that's true, I don't know. The Guru can heal units, which is nice. Apostles are expensive. I need a trader for Perth, don't I? pit or wherever. Just get into the general vicinity and we'll work out where you can go from there. I 
What about the other units? I just built a guru. Does he not move? Hmm. Or is it Guru? This? I don't know. I think the human race made a big mistake at the beginning of the Industrial Revolution. We leaped for the mechanical things. People need the use of their hands to feel creative. Improvement makes straight roads. But the crooked roads without improvement are roads of genius. More housing. Where needed. Neighborhoods. Where needed. So he's got his housing now, so I could build Mont Saint Michel. for the sake of it. St. Michael's Mount. Oh, Yalza, yeah, well. Better be ancient walls first. Right, okay. I'll have cheaper modern units and I still want cheaper builders, to be honest, um, or quicker to build. And there are other things. 100% science from campus district buildings would be good if I'm trying to be maybe go for a science victory. I want to build settlers and builders all the time. Well, I'll buy builders, yes, and I'll have extra science. That is what I'll do. Okay. Just told you, hop it up here. Another belief possible? That's also good, but evangelizing belief is if I can get the extra science from believers. Actually, that's you know quite something. I can. Okay. So now it's worth me converting other cities if I can. I want a trader from here. I need to be making more money than that as well. Hmm. 
What do you think? Missionary or apostle? Missionary, I suppose. I'll probably need uh, some more gurus, actually. Why can't I go there? My own guys is there, right. Coal? Where? Under here, perhaps, is it? And there, right. So, possibly under there. Whoops. Doesn't say so, is it here? And say so. Somewhere around here there is some invisible coal, but here it's visible. And you were supposed to go and meet up with this boat. Oops, I've annoyed him. <laughs> well, bully for you. They're a bit far away. So I don't know that I'll be able to convert Japan so easily. Can I upgrade the ship to a frigate? Doesn't look like it. Hmm. I mean, I should have some better navy, um, I suppose, before anything else. Frigates are good. I can build it quickly. I should build units just in case, I suppose. I can't think of what they might possibly do, but... 
from where they are. It's ridiculous. But I can build a cavalry corps really quickly. Ah, Perth 2. Quite good for my money here. But I want Perth to grow rapidly, so we're looking at Sydney, and it anyway produces a road across across Oz. There's nothing to say I couldn't build another one, just to speed things up a bit. Um, So he's found the caravel and he's joined up with it. That was my original intention. Or whatever it is, and get a get a road up there as well. Okay, yeah, begin route. Right. making some money as well. Okay, heal up. Heal religious units. Kapow, very good. Now, are you close enough to zap him? No. So the caravel here is destroying my units. I'd better send somebody up to help.
If I'm at war, then, can my units kill? I thought religious units were, like, immune. Well, we'll find out. Maybe not when you're at war. What I like about cities is that everything is king size. The beauty and the ugliness. Skip man. I want the I'm trying to click on the boat. What's going on? Come back. Oh, Egypt. Frigate. How the heck did the musket man get selected? Can't get past, but let's see if he can. Using up the faith rapidly. I've done something for the Preslav city-state, I don't know what. My income is going down rapidly because I'm building the military units just in case. But I think 
I'm pretty safe, actually, but it doesn't hurt to be safe. The military units have maintenance costs. No innovation costs. in the past 200 years has done more to save lives and improve health than the sanitation revolution, triggered by the invention of the toilet. Now, this could be the end of me if, um... If it occupies the hex afterwards. Oh dear, he's gone and moved, yeah, into the ocean. Right next to the caravel. Annoying. Now he was going to Sydney. I think what I'll do is make a route across to what Cairns or Rockhampton or Rockhampton. Okay, or Rockhampton, I suppose. Can't move out of the way, oh dear. But my caravel is on its way. Maybe too late though. Oh, he could have been promoted. Okay, go back and promote. Sort out some money. No pluses here, but it's relatively useless jungle. There's a plus one here. And it's I can put a harbour there to boost it some more, I think, so I'll do that. I need a road across here, don't I, as well? Excellent cavalry corps. Who's the great person? Great general? Yes. 
extra combat strength for movement to industrial and modern era land units, or an army out of a military land unit. Forms it well. That's pretty good. Okay, Napoleon. Um, come here. Oh, oh, can you not? Just go there for the moment. And you can join up with that. But I don't suppose there's going to be any invasion or anything. But... He's, he's there waiting, right, just in case. Let's head up this way, my frigate. I have anywhere where I can put a commercial hub. This would be a good place for a farm, you see. They've got plenty of food. Hmm. Plus five. But it's a high productivity place. It should make plenty of money then as well, shouldn't it? Less productivity, but more money. Frigate due there shortly. Missionary on his way. Can't do it, he's only just arrived. Okay. So I'll see you in part six. Bye for now. If it will let me.